Hangouts on Air are gone. No, they're not. <laughs> they're only moving from Google Plus to YouTube. That's the only difference. So what does that mean and how do you make sure that you can still launch a Hangout on Air, embed it on your website and all is well in the world? Well, the only difference, if you're used to launching Hangouts from Google+, you used to log into your Google+, go to Hangouts, right? Come here to Hangouts on Air and create a Hangout on Air. When you try to do that now, it tells you that they move to YouTube Live and after September 12, Right? You won't be able to launch Hangouts on Air from Google Plus anymore. That's the only difference. The difference is, is that now, instead of coming to Google Plus and launching a Hangout from here, you have to go to YouTube and launch a Hangout from here. Creator Studio, Live Streaming, and Events. That's the only difference. The difference is that you cannot launch a Hangout from Google Plus here but you can launch it from YouTube via events. Super easy. So now that you're in YouTube and you wanna launch your live event, your Hangout event, you just click on create an event, super easy. You put in all the information that you would as you would in Google+, right? When you wanted to create this, you need to give it a name, tell people what it was about and decide when you want to do it. Same thing in YouTube. You're going to give it a title. You're going to decide when you want to launch the Hangout. You're going to give it a description, YouTube description, tags that help it be found. Whether it's public or unlisted or private, you can choose any of these options. Now here is the caveat. When you go to advanced settings, you need to make sure that this option, allow embedding, you can, it's not grayed out that you can embed Hangouts. When you look at the distribution options and allow embedding is grayed out, you can click on this link and it will tell you why you are not able to embed live streams. If you want to embed your live stream on a site, you need to have an approved AdSense account linked to your YouTube account. And this is why I cannot embed Hangouts, which means that if I cannot embed Hangouts, I can't use Webinar Jam, I can't use 22 Social, and I can't um, embed the Hangout on my website. The only way people can see that is if they come to my YouTube channel. So to fix that, here is what you need to do. You need to click on Channel, and you'll see here Embed Live Streams. So you must have an active AdSense account linked to your YouTube account, okay? So I need to activate that. And if I click on it, it says this feature is not available in your country. Because I know that I'm in a country that allows monetization, um, the setting, the YouTube settings for my account is not correct. To change that, I'm gonna go to Channel Advance right here. And I noticed that the country that Google has is Afghanistan. So I am not in Afghanistan, I am actually in the US. So I can change that. And I can also, while I'm here, right, I can also uh, create the channel keywords. I can also link my account to AdWords from here and I can also create an associated website. We are only worrying about the monetization right now. So I change it to United States and I am going to save. And now that I saved it and I changed the settings to the correct country, let me try to monetize it again. So I'm gonna click on, I can go from here, LinkedIn AdWords account, but let's just see if this works. I'm gonna click here. And now I get the option to monetize my account. So I'm gonna enable my account for monetization. I'm gonna get all the regular terms. Of course, you have to check and agree to all of them, accept. And now Google, YouTube is asking you, how do you, you want to monetize your account? You have an option. You can choose overlay video ads and you can see what it looks like. You can have skippable ones. You can have sponsored card, or you can check all of these off because display ads are showing by default and that's part of the monetization. This is how YouTube monetizes it. So you can choose what ad format you want to show, or you can skip, or you can monetize. I'm going to click monetize. And now Google is showing me that it has updated my 
settings for just one video that I have and I can choose how to monetize the rest of my video. Got it? Now I don't have any videos here, so nothing is going to be monetized. And I get this notice, you must link your channel to an AdSense account in order to monetize it, right? So I can link my account from here, but before I do that, I want to see whether or not I can embed a Hangout now. So I'm gonna go to events, create a live event, advance. I can still not do that. Why not? Because I don't have the AdSense account connected. So I'm gonna click here and link to my account. On this page, you need to either sign in to your Google account or create a new Google account. Now, the same Gmail address that you're using for your analytics, for your AdSense will apply here. You're just gonna sign in here. So YouTube is now connecting my AdSense account to my website, which is basically my channel. And I am going to accept the association. Now, if you don't have anything here, you do need to create a website and association between a YouTube account and a Google AdSense account. We have our YouTube account. This is the website. Put your YouTube channel URL in here and click accept association. Now it's redirecting me back to YouTube. And there you go. Let's see if I can embed website, if I can embed Hangouts. So back to events create a live event, AdSense, and now I'm allowed embedding. So these are the steps, super easy, takes five minutes to set it all up and start launching Hangouts exactly the same way as you did before, only instead of Google+, directly from YouTube. I hope this helps. Um, you can subscribe to my channel for more awesome information and please feel free to share it with anyone that you think might benefit. I'll see you in the next video.